how to use our new exciting product called Colourbug. Now, high def colour has been on the catwalks for the last couple of seasons, but you can't really just take a model and colour hair just because you feel like it. So I wanted high def colour without the commitment, and I thought to myself, why can't hair colour be as easy to apply as makeup? Always put a towel over the shoulders to protect your clothes. So we're just going to take a towel. Now, you want to apply the colour bug to uh, pre-styled or already dried hair. Now, the idea of the colour bug is to make the bug stick to product. So you want to apply a bit of product to your hair. So you want to take a product like, say, Hair Resort Spray, Texture Master. Uh, for more intensity in the colour, you're going to use products like, say, Night Rider. Night Rider will give you a more intense colour and Texture Master will give you a sort of softer sort of colour or softer texture. So if you want the colour to be more intense, you want to use a thicker, pastier product or if you want the colour to be lighter and more natural you want to choose like a hair resort spray, anti-gravity spray or any sort of setting product so your aim is to grab the product and then slightly dampen the hair where you want the colour bug to stick and then you want to take your colour bug which is in purple which is very nice and then you apply the colour bug to the hair product like so and then you make the product and the colour bug merge into each other. So it's a bit like using makeup. You have your foundation, your foundation is damp and then you set the foundation with powder and massage that in until you feel the product has totally dried. And then a bit of a shake just to shake off any excess. Now we're going to do pink. So you put the colour bug straight over the top of the product and rub it in. So you keep rubbing on until you get the product completely dried by the powder. And as you can see, everything is completely water soluble, it comes off straight away. If your hair is like super blonde or super bleached, um, you'd want to probably use a bit of leave-in conditioner. Now we might put a little bit of pink up around here in the hairline. So the more product you put on, the more intense the colour bug colour is. And you can see where we've put hardly any product, the colour's not as strong. And when we've placed product, the colour's really, really strong. So it is just for the one night. So the great thing is that it washes out the next day instantly. If you want the, the colour to be more pastel, you can also mix it with a bit of fresh hair. So I would apply the colour bug first and then take some fresh hair, which is the dry shampoo, and apply that after you've applied the colour bug. Just squirt that into the hair and you get a nice sort of washed out effect. The best thing about it is it's really high definition colour but it's just for the one night and it washes out completely in the morning. And there's your colour bug on the blonde hair. Now I'm going to show you how colour bug reacts on dark hair. We're going to use Night Rider because Night Rider has a lot more of an intense grab onto the colour bug so that's going to make it show up in these darker shades of hair. We dried Night Rider into the hair uh, to create more of a rockabilly type effect out of the hair. Now I'm going to take the Night Rider and apply it to each section that we want the colour to show up on. So you can take a bit of Night Rider onto your fingers and pop that into the palms of your hand just to warm that up a little bit. Really get that into the palms of your hand so you're going to get that all the way through. Voila. Okay, now we're ready to apply the colour bug. Because Sam's hair is dark, we're going to go for the purple one. So you want to take the little colour bug like so and just wipe that onto the hair. Really press that colour bug into the hair and really merge that colour bug in with the product. And you can see you're getting a lot of colour onto dark hair and never before have you been able to actually get this intensity of colour that looks like there's nothing in the hair apart from colour. So you can see what I'm doing is I'm just taking the colour bug and then wiping it over onto that hair and making the colour bug stick to the product. You really want to merge the colour bug into the Night Rider. And then just with your fingertips just really rub that in to avoid any fall off. Okay, so there's your colour bug on short dark hair.